Hi everyone, Ulysses here from Microchip Technology. Welcome back to Ask Our Experts. We're talking about silicon carbide again, and to help answer our question, we welcome back Orlando Esparza. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Orlando, what is the future of silicon carbide semiconductors? Silicon carbide semiconductors have a very bright future. Um, you know, when you look at what they're replacing, they're replacing silicon uh, devices, which have really reached limitations in innovation of those applications, and also um, you know lowering cost and 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 shrinking uh, the size of those applications. So, be, you know, silicon's been a, a, around and, and been used in many high power applications for a very long time. Again, they've reached those limitations. So wide band gap is an alternative that can t take them to the next step. They can continue to innovate, shrink, lower weight, uh, get, get more efficient applications. Uh, so n there's a lot of different end markets, a lot of different industries that can benefit from all of those things that, that, that were, I just discussed. So very bright future because it's being looked at across many different end markets and, and many different types of applications. Thanks, Orlando. That sounds exciting. It's fascinating to see how the silicon carbide devices will shape our future. From EVs and transportation to energy systems, industrial, medical, and aerospace applications, silicon carbide semiconductors are at the forefront of innovation. To our viewers, to learn more about the industry's broadest and most flexible portfolio of SIC devices, check out the links in the description below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to be the first to know when we have more insights from our experts. We'll see you next time.